Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can recover your unsaved or lost Excel files very easily in few simple steps. So I'm going to show you a few different ways of recovering your unsaved or lost Excel files. So let's see them one by one. So let me open my Excel app first of all. And once uh, this app is open, I'm going to uh, open an Excel file, let's say. And uh, once this Excel file is open, let's say I'm working on this file. And uh, then I make some changes here. And then somehow my PC crashes or uh, somehow my battery dies or any other uh, scenario where your Excel app crashes and your data is unsaved right so if you uh, want to just close this excel app it's going to give you the option of saving or not saving your excel file but in case of crash this excel file will be crashed without giving you the opportunity to uh, just save your file so let me just simulate that scenario and then we are going to see how we can uh, recover this uh, Excel file. So as you can see, I have deleted some data. And now what I'm going to do, I'm going to just right click here and then click on uh, task manager and then click on processes if it's already not selected. And now I'm going to select Excel, which is opened. And then I'm going to click on end task. That means I'm uh, intentionally crashing my uh, Excel app. So when I just click on end task, my Excel crashes or closes without saving my data. So essentially my uh, work is lost, right? So how I can recover it. So to recover it, what I can do is I can just open my Excel app once again. And then here you will be able to see the options uh, uh, tab. Otherwise, if you don't see the options tab here and if you have the older version of Microsoft Excel, then just open any blank sheet and then you will be able to see uh, some document recovery options. If you don't see this document recovery options, that's also okay. But if you see the document recovery option, then you can just uh, select the document which you want to recover and then just save it so just uh, click on the document you want to recover and then just click on file and then click on save and then give any name to your uh, file and then browse where you want to save your data and then your excel file will be recovered but if you don't see this document recovery section here what you can do here is you can just click on files once again and you will be able to see the options uh, tab once again here. So just click on the options tab and then click on save option. Now these are some of the options uh, which uh, Excel uses to save your Excel files. So the format is Excel SX in my case and the save auto recover information every one minute in my case by default it's 10 right so i have reduced it to one so my unsaved data will be saved somewhere every one minute so make sure that from the next time you reduce it to one minute for example also you will be able to see uh, this option which says keep the last auto recovered version if I close without saving and the location is this one. So just copy this path. So I'm going to just copy this path and then I'm going to close my Excel app or let me just crash it once again. So the data is unsaved. And then once your Excel is closed totally, then just open your folder explorer and in the folder explorer, just paste this path which you have copied okay and then press enter and here you will be able to see some files and directories and one of these files will be the name of your unsaved or lost file so in my case this is the file which i crashed uh, intentionally so i will just go inside this folder 
and then I will just click on uh, this file you can right click here and then you can click on open with and then select Excel and it's going to open this uh, in Excel once again right and the procedure is same you just need to save this file so you can see right now it's in auto recovered version and it's read only so you need to save this file in order to recover it so click on OK and then browse to the location where you want to save this file let's say I will just save this file in my downloads folder and now it's fully recovered so this was the first way of recovering your lost or unsaved file. Now in some scenarios, you just delete your file and you don't know how to recover it. So the process for that is also simple. So let me just close this file. And let's say I just deleted this Excel file. So I'm going to right click and delete it. And in those kind of scenarios where you suddenly deleted your uh, uh, excel files you can always go to your uh, recycle bin and from here uh, you can just right click on the file you want to restore and then click on restore so your file will be restored to the location from where you have deleted your files right so in my case it's uh, the uh, downloads uh, folder but your in your case it can be different from where you have deleted your files okay so this was the second way let me show you a few more ways so sometimes excel saves your uh, files in the temp directory of your windows operating system so for this you just need to right click on your windows icon you need to right click not the left click but the right click right so right click on your windows icon and then click on run and here you just need to type uh, this percentage temp percentage okay so just type percentage temp percentage and then click on ok and this is the folder where your temporary files are saved so you can just uh, filter according to the dates so you can just uh, click on this option and then click on either the date on which you are were working on your excel file or you can choose today yesterday or earlier and it's going to show me all the files uh, which uh, are gone in the temp file today itself right so this was the third way let me show you the last way and uh, this is the same so if you don't know uh, the location where your excel saves your uh, uh, auto recover files then you can once again right click on your windows icon and then click on run and instead of writing temp here so percentage percentage and in between you just need to write app data so capital a pp and then data here and then press enter and it's going to uh, open this kind of uh, folder and here you will be able to see this Microsoft option and then you will be able to see the Excel option and here you will be able to see the folders with the same name of the Excel file which you want to recover so you can go inside that folder and then auto recover them okay so these are the few different ways in which you can recover your lost or unsaved Excel file so I hope you've enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next video